Question three says, complete the diagram below to make a shape that is symmetrical about the mirror line. Use a ruler. So there's our shape. There's our mirror line, which is our line of symmetry. And we've got to make a shape that's symmetrical. Now, there are three methods we could use to do this. Method number one would be just to get a mirror, place the mirror on the mirror line, look inside the mirror, and what you see inside the mirror is what you have to draw on the other side of the mirror line. Some people can answer this question using only a mirror alone. Method number two involves taking each corner one at a time, counting the gap of squares, the number of squares to the mirror line, and then repeating that same distance on the other side to get the corresponding corner in the reflection. So for example, this corner is one, two, three squares to the mirror line. So we do the same again on the other side. One, two, three squares would mean that corner goes there. This corner is already on the mirror line, so it's no squares to the mirror line, zero distance, so that corner when it's reflected stays where it is. This corner is also on the mirror line, so when it's reflected that will stay where it is. This corner is one, two, three to the mirror line, so we go the same again, one, two, three on the other side. Once we've got our three corners, we just simply join them up. Obviously, you would use a ruler for this. And once you join them up, that is your reflected shape. The final method for doing this would actually be to get a piece of tracing paper, trace the original shape, but not only trace the original shape, also trace the mirror line. That's very important. Now, once you've traced this, you need to flip the tracing paper over. When we say flip over, we definitely do not mean rotate it. Flipping over and rotating is two completely different things. So once you've flipped it over, bring your tracing paper in here and replace the mirror line that you've traced back over the original mirror line like this. And then just line the two shapes up. So you can see that on the tr tracing paper, that is now where you would have to draw the shape. And the easiest thing to do then would be to mark off each corner by peeling up the tracing paper and marking the corners on. So peel this corner up and mark the corner on. Peel this corner up, mark the corner on. Peel this up, mark the corner on. Once you've got the four corners, you can join it up. So to recap, method number one is to use a mirror, look inside the mirror and draw the shape on the other side. Method number two is to count the distance from each corner to the mirror line and repeat that distance on the other side of the mirror line. And method number three will be to trace the shape, including the mirror line, flip over the whole piece of tracing paper, place it on the mirror line, and then draw the corners where you need to draw them and join the shape up.